you. Hi guys, today is Tuesday. Hello guys. <laughs> I'm here with my little boy Dylan. And I doing video. So my daughter just got back to school yesterday on Monday and Oh. Today we're I going What are you doing, mommy? <laughs> he's pretending to do a video. Actually, he's doing the video. <laughs> And today I'm just going to show you guys a little oh, bit of what I do on That's my right. day. Today is Tuesday, January... That point. What is it, 9th? What yeah. is it, 9th? It's the 9th? Oh, and I'm here. We just dropped off my daughter, Melody. And right now we're outside the gym. We're about to go in. And there's a daycare for the little kids. So Dylan yeah. is going to be there. Thank you. Um, so right now it's 9.13 a.m. I'll be here for like about yeah, an hour. And then, <laughs> he's getting me distracted. And then um, yeah, yeah. I think bye -bye, we're going to go buy some ingredients for dinner. It's a busy day today on Tuesdays. So we're back to the routine. My daughter has um, Girl Scouts. Mm -hmm. So... Busy, busy. And there's no soccer practice, so that's good. So that's that's one less thing to do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but there will Bye. be soccer practice on Thursday, so it's gonna be busy every day, pretty much. Okay, guys, so let's go. Maybe I'll record a little bit inside. I don't know. Ding. Bye. We are here at the grocery store and there's a Starbucks. There's Dylan with the scone. Yeah, we drink. Drink? And then why are you? It's like this. <laughs> How do you do that? And my face. I got the mango dragon fruit. Hey guys, we are back home. I already went to the dollar store, we went to the grocery store. <clears throat> so I got these little containers from the dollar store. They're like this. It's just um, one. I got this to organize my tea packets. Let me show you. I'm trying to organize here. I do want to get a table just for like all the coffee and tea. But for now, I have it just, or maybe I just leave it here, I don't know. When I organize everything, I do have my mugs on top. have mugs here on those two, and cups, and then just these ones. Like when we go out, or coffee. And here's the coffee maker. Um, so here just have all the cups it's mostly my husband he's the one who drinks coffee and if we have guests um we do offer coffee and this is the hot chocolate and marshmallows and brown sugar so i do like um ginger tea whenever i feel bloated or i just need like to ease my stomach and get this and this is this is really really good if you ever feel bloated this helps a lot it's the steep organic lemon ginger i got this at i'm not sure if it's 
Sam's Club or Target? It's a big box, so I'm thinking Sam's Club. But they have it at Target. I've seen it there too. And my husband does like his sugar. He gets the stevia. So I'm thinking like how should I organize it? Um, I'll probably just put the sugars here. I do need to clean this drawer and maybe put like the sugars and teas. There's still a lot of organizing I have to do in this house. I'll probably keep moving things around. And I also got this at the dollar store. It's a set of two, but I'm not sure if I'm gonna be using this to organize the teas and sugar, or if I'm gonna use this for the kids' restroom. I was thinking maybe to one for each, to put like their toothpaste and toothbrush. I don't like it outside in the restroom. I just like them in the drawer just because I think like all the bacteria and stuff, I don't like it. Um, so there's more sugar here. It's a little mixed. So that's why I'm trying to organize on oh, this is just the condiments, like what I use. This is really cool. So it moves around. I don't have that many condiments. So I don't use that much. I really recommend this one. I like this when I eat my avocado toast. I got this at Target. And it's the everything bagel. Right? No, it doesn't say everything bagel. It's just seasoning blend. I think I've seen one like this at Sam's Club. But it's big bottle. And it says everything bagel. So that's why I got confused. Um, there's more sugar. This one we mostly use it for baking. We make um, coffee cake on that one too. So as you can see, it's a little mix. It's not that very organized right now. And this is what I'm making for dinner today. I'm gonna make um, pasta. My windows, they have um, foiling paper. We're gonna get shutters by the end of the month or the beginning of February. So it will look nicer, hopefully. And then we're gonna put the dining table here in the middle. I just need to mop, that's why everything is there. So I'm gonna make pasta today. I was planning on making a little bit of pasta, but I'm gonna make extra just to take to my parent, my parents' house. My dad, he works overnight. And yeah, right now it's 11.56 a.m., almost 12. So I'm gonna hurry up, make him, well, I'm not sure if he's home, but hopefully he is. Yeah, got this at dollar store. If you have kids, I'm gonna open it right now and see See what it's about. I know this is shapes and colors. And this one, oh, here's the back. So I got an idea. They have this at the, I think it was at the Valentine's section. I'm not sure. So this is what it is. So my little boy is four years old and he's not in school yet, but he will start kindergarten this um, August. So, there's nothing else there. Okay. So, here's what I have so far. The box was not full. There's how many packets? There's 60. And I did use like almost half or less than half. I'm not sure. So, this is what I have. And I have some chamomile tea. This is really good if you want to just relax a little. Be a little relaxed. I'm just thinking maybe of putting that in the other half of the bin. Might fit. Let's find out. And then I don't know with all this moving, I'm just gonna let it go. And I do add Whenever I do this um, organ organizing things, I do like to add the expiration date. Um, that way I know 
when it's going to expire because sometimes the packets don't have it. See, they don't show expiration date. So, there's expiration date. Well, not the expiration date. This is the T. As you can see, it doesn't show any expiration date. It's only on the box. Which is... Let's see. March 2025. I'll probably finish it by... <laughs> the chamomile in the back. And I do have a little piece of paper. I have a label maker. Um, I just don't know where it is right now. I'll probably do it here. Need scissors. Let's get this going. Um, So I'm going to write chamomile and the expiration date. I said May 2025. Just like this. And then I'll just put it here. And I'll do this paper and I'm going to write down ginger tea oh, the other side and expiration date I think it's this year um, June 2024 I got this a while back um, let me cut it a little smaller. Just put it right there. So that way, if I want to know when it expires, I just look it up here. That's it. With the T. I do have a lot of um, coffee. He gets the coffee cups from Sam's Club, so obviously there's a big box. And I don't know how to organize it all. Okay, so I'm gonna put this here. This is going to be the tea and sugar section. And then I'm gonna put the rest. This is like the extra. Coffee cups. I'm gonna put that under. And then. Okay. And this one is hot chocolate. It expires April 3rd, 2024. Hot cocoa. I'm gonna put it just in here and we have two boxes of sugar they expired 2026 I don't think I need to write the expiration date here it's not that many so you already use a lot of the sugar Yeah. I don't really know how to make coffee for myself. Um, I'm not really a coffee drinker. Once in a while, I do like um, iced coffee. 
when I feel like a little, I need a little bit of energy. So there's still more space here, as you can see. I'm gonna get the other box that I have here. I think I got another one somewhere. Look, this is a bigger one. We have a recipe. Okay, so this one, it's definitely more full. There's coupons. So there was coupons here and I just ate the box. But I'm not sure from what store. Okay, so I'm just making dinner right now. I'm gonna make sausage with um, pasta. So this is the sauce I will be using. It's my first time using this one. It's the vodka sauce. Um, and this is sausage. I use about three. I did use onion. Um, I used about not even half the onion because I used a piece of the onion another day for something else. In a little container. I got this at the grocery store. Really cute. And here I'm just doing the onion. Getting a little bit caramelized before I add the sausage and here's my pasta it's not done yet I used the whole box this is for eight people this is the one I got I do want to take some for my parents uh, my dad works overnight and my mom uh, she's working right now she gets off around three i believe so i might stop by and just drop some food and probably just go after dropping off the food i just go to my pick up my daughter i'm not sure i'm still thinking what i'm gonna do um but yeah the boiling now it's time to add the sausage so now that i added the sausage i'm just going to cook the sausage a little and usually when i make pasta i like to add well once it's cooked i like to add some of the sauce i use about half and then when i add the pasta i use the other half and then i just mix it and just to get the sauce all over the hopefully this is a big enough pot. Normally I don't make that much pasta. My husband did say don't make a lot of food <laughs> because we're trying to make or well, we're planning on making um, chicken soup in the night. We make the chicken soup in the crock pot and then just let it let it cook and then um, what's I'm gonna say and then in the morning the soup is ready. So you make the food, I mean the soup in the crock pot but it's for the next day. It's really really good. Maybe I I do a little video, I don't know. I'll we'll probably be making the soup while I'm at the Girl Scouts with my daughter. Um, she has Girl Scouts at 5.30 today. It does get pretty busy once they go back to their routine.
my brother just sent me a message asking what am I doing right now and I replied to him I say I'm just home and then he just didn't say nothing back I'm like I'm home what about you and that's it probably just woke up so the pasta it's almost done Hope everybody likes it. <laughs> this is really good for um, tortillas. Tortillas. Oh, I don't know, like sandwich maybe? I just use it for my tortillas. And that's it. And it comes off. I said, oh, it's really, really hot. It comes off and then I can just use the bigger. Okay. So, to lower the heat because it's a gas stove. I mean, this is gonna go really quick. <laughs> With electric stoves, it takes longer to make food. This is almost done. Yesterday, I made chicken with vegetables, and I was going to give my husband chicken with vegetables for lunch today, but I was going to use this container. It's really cool. It has a fork and spoon. I'm trying to open it. But let me put the camera down here. this little spoon and fork and you just twist a little tricky to do with one hand but you get the idea there it is and there goes the food and it stays hot for a couple hours because he's always driving his work he doesn't have access to a microwave sometimes so it's better to use this um, type of containers I think we got this at I'm not sure if it was Target or Sam's Club I don't know it comes in a packet of two like this I'm thinking Target but I don't know and there it is pretty useful okay i think the pasta is almost done i need to try one Perfect. So now, this is cooked, definitely. I like onions. Smells good. Sometimes it's really hard to open, but a little tip, you just, cause you know, it's hard to open. So all you have to do is give it a little tap, tap on the top and then twist the cap and it will open right away. So this is the end result guys, here's my food, mm, let's see, let's see, let's see, my first time making this, so I don't know, mm. I like it, I hope he likes it too, try it, Dula, <laughs> I still have Christmas napkins guys.
been having them for a year or two. This is all we have left, so I'm just gonna mix them all. So I really recommend this, guys. 10 out of 10. <laughs> If you don't like sausage, that's fine. You, you can use it without the sausage. You can add some cheese. I don't have Parmesan cheese, so. Really good. I like it. So when I'm done, I think I'm gonna mop. My brother just told me that my dad is still sleeping, so I might pack him some lunch. And for my mom as well so that way when my mom gets home she has food and my dad doesn't have to worry about making food and then i'll go i might go to pick up my daughter after maybe 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 right here okay guys see you guys in a little bit